Ah, do you remember the time when you first got your XM Fours? How smooth it looked, how fresh it smelled. But it's been a while, and perhaps your cushions are starting to flake, or even worse, get sticky and smelly. Or perhaps you've seen the XM Fives, and you don't feel the need to upgrade. Instead, you want to change your XM Fours cushions. So in this video, brought to you by Tacony. I'm going to show you how to replace your Mark IV cushions to get it looking fresh and smelling nice again. This, my friends, is the EarPads Platinum from the Kony, and it's almost like a one-to-one -one copy of the original cushions. The texture of the leather is almost the same. You have the port for the IR sensor on the left ear cup, and the cushions are a bit more plush, so there's a small bonus to comfort. I've tested them, and they fit perfectly on the XM4s, as you're about to see. First, let's start by making sure you're working in a clean environment, because as much as possible, you don't want any dust to get into the components of your headphones. Second, you need a flat, blunt tool. The Kony provides a tool just like this one to ease things up a bit, but really, you can use even a flathead screwdriver or a nail clipper. As long as it's not a sharp object that could potentially rip the cushions, you're cool. Next, you ought to place the headphones flat on the surface, cushions facing upwards. And let me just zoom in for this part so you can see. Okay. Next, I need you to start from the top edge and push the tool in. Use the tool to feel for the bracket. The bracket is this plastic piece that secures the cushions to the ear cups. So I need you to feel for that part is this plastic piece. And when you have it, when the tool catches on to the bracket, I need you to pry. Do you hear that click? Okay, that is the cushions being freed from the ear cup. So work your way down and pry slowly along the way until you hear click after click. Slowly, yeah, slowly. You don't want to break the bracket. Okay, I think I'm done with this part. Okay, let me check. Yep, it's freed. Let me do the other side again, starting from the top. Just slowly fry. Fry. You can hear the pins being freed from the ear cup. Ah, oh, the sound of freedom. Yeah. Okay, I think we're almost there. Last part. Okay, cool. So we have freed the cushion from the ear cup. Now, see this part here? This is the foam that covers the drivers. Do not do not remove this. It protects the drivers from dust and other particles. Okay, so let's put the old cushion aside. Let's take the, the Kony one. Pins, bracket pins, okay? The pins align with the holes and the slots here. So make sure they're aligned. Also make sure that you're getting the right side. This is the side with the IR sensor. So take the one with the IR port and slowly once you feel that the pins and the holes are aligned press on the cushions do not press in the middle because you might damage the drivers press on the cushion top and bottom first top and bottom okay then work your way around the corners along the sides Yep, like this. And finally, make sure that all the pins are secured by tugging a little on the cushions. There, perfect. Simply repeat the steps for the other side, which I am going to do right now. Again, start from the top. You put the plastic piece. 
put my weight down. Oh, okay, this one's easier. Cool. Now I'm very seasoned, so I'm going pretty fast, but uh, I recommend not to go this fast because it might snap the bracket. Okay, pins, holes aligned, rest top and bottom together. Okay, then work your way along the sides, avoiding the middle. make sure that the cushions are secured by tugging on it tugging the sides okay cool so we have replaced the cushions the final thing that you need to do now is to turn the headphones on wear them then activate ANC optimizer by pressing and holding down on the custom button this is gonna bring the noise cancelling back into balance. Now, these are the EarPads Platinum tried and proven replacement cushions for the Mark IV, but the Kony also has the choice selection. If you feel that the XM4's cushions are too shallow and it bothers you that your ears are touching the back of the ear cups, these will make a great alternative. It makes the ear cups super deep and these are so, so soft. I mean, they're like pillows when you wear them on your head. They come in two different colors and styles. We have them in black or gray, in leather or suede. If you like to work out with the XM4s, I imagine the suede one is great. These are more breathable, sweat absorbing, and you install them the same way as you would the platinum ear cups. Now, I've installed them myself, and once again, the bracket, it's a perfect fit. One thing you gotta know about Bigger, plus-sized cushions, they generally allow more internal resonance into the ear cups. This will impact the noise blocking, which means ANC will be a little weaker. But some of you may feel that that trade-off is worth it, and you would rather have deeper, more comfortable ear cups. Otherwise, there's always the Platinum, which offers the classic XM4 experience. All the Kony cushions for the XM4 are made of high-density, heat-activated memory foam that forms to your head. They only use vegan leather, and they all come with that nifty spudger tool. Best of all, they are covered by a two-year warranty, which is even more than what Sony's offering with their own cushions. So you can go ahead and shop in confidence. Link in the description if you'd like to order them. Thanks for watching, smash like and share if you like this video. If you want to see more XM4 or XM5 related content, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified of new videos from me. A big shout out to my Patreon supporters as always. You can also join us on the world's most popular gaming chat app Discord if you want to hang out or chat, link is in the box down below. Click here to watch me compare the XM4s to the latest model, the XM5s, or watch another video from this channel.